The Husky special teams have taken leaps forward over the past two seasons with the addition of Doug Humbert to the coaching staff. This was evident last year as the Huskies rarely gave up big returns on kicks and had solid kick returns and place kicking, especially in the last half of the season. Learning to play on special teams can be tough, especially as a young player, as you must learn additional assignments and must be alert to calls the entire game. The Huskies have done a good job at integrating players into special teams, and it shows, with Luke Teal being named a Canada West All-Star at kick returner in 2010, and with place kicker Stephen McDonald, who played only six games last season, but finished second in Canada West scoring with 72 points. Both punter Denton Kolodzinski and place kicker McDonald returned from last season, and they faced competition in training camp with the addition of kicker Cole Sampson. While each kicker has his area of strength, Humbert is not convinced any jobs have been won just yet. You know, really, I don't think that we've really identified a number one kicker yet. I would think that in terms of punting, I think Denton Kolodzinski has probably emerged as, as the top one there. But in terms of field goal kicking, you know, all three of them have... Uh, been doing pretty well. I think the biggest thing we're looking for right now is some consistency right. and that's probably the one thing that's not not there just yet. For Humbert, coaching the kickers is just as much about working on a player's confidence as it is about the physical aspects of the position. Uh, and you know and I think that's probably the most important part of the yeah. kickers we just we've been talking about that a lot the last couple of days just the you know the positive self-talk and, and, and the confidence they need to you know, I think once they get in a bit of a roll and start hitting some good punts, it's only going to get better. And, you know, right now, like I say, they're a little tired. The legs are a little bit tired and they're a little inconsistent. But uh, we talk about the confidence of it. And they've got to get out and work hard and get some reps in and, uh, and get better. Humbert is also intrigued by the many talented kick returners available to him this year. Luke Teal, we got Kit Hillis back there, uh, and Jared Lambert's doing a good job. Uh, Derek, or pardon me, uh, Janky's doing a good job, as you said. Uh, and uh, we've got a couple other kids that are doing a good job. But, you know, I think when we start our punt return, it's probably going to be Luke and Kit to start off with. But uh, you're going to see Jared Lambert out there and also uh, Garrett Burgess as well. Right. He's been doing a good job. So uh, I think we've got some good depth there, which is nice. And... Uh, you know, we're excited. We've got some good people up front that are going to be doing the blocking for them and uh, looking forward to the game Friday night to see what we can do with our return game. Right. After starting last year off with an injury, McDonald struggled through his first two games before finishing the year off with 15 straight field goals in the last four regular season games and one playoff game. He was hoping he can build on the momentum he had in the second half of last season. Uh, yeah, we just kind of hope to carry on what we built towards the end of last season with us kickers. I mean, the special teams got better as the season went, so all of us kind of worked hard over the summer, and it's paying off. We all are a little tired from two days, legs need a day's rest, but should be ready to go by Friday. McDonald spent time this offseason in the kicking camp of coach Gary Zahner, a former NFL special teams coach. He has taken a lot away from that experience, and he feels it will improve aspects of his game. It was like a lot of fundamental stuff, but I got a lot of film on me down there. So uh, it is benefiting in the sense that I can see myself kicking and when I'm not hitting it well, I see what I'm doing. And when I do hit it well, I see the difference. Mm -hmm. So hopefully it helps in the long run. It's still, I'm still working on some stuff I learned down there. So. Right. For news and insight on Husky football during the 2011 season, make sure to visit huskyoutsider.com and follow our Twitter feed and Facebook page.